you can be broke and sexy. Let's not get it twisted. Valentine's Day is right around the corner, and if you're gonna spend money on dinner, flowers, chocolate, jewelry, you might as well save a little bit of bread on some fragrance, some scented water. Because the funny thing about this commercialized holiday called Valentine's Day is due to usually get the shaft. Either she bribes you with some butt, that you should be getting anyway. If you are dad, it's a gift from your kids, which usually is some socks or a tie, you work from home. Meanwhile, we're going into wild debt, trying to figure out how to charge back or do a little credit card fraud, you know what I'm saying? Just so we can offset the money we've spent. So I've put together 10 sexy clone fragrances that you either have in your stash or you can potentially get to save you some dough last minute. Let's roll my music so I can put you onto 10 sexy clones that your ass could be wearing for Valentine's Day. Sexy Bless you, morning, my beautiful peoples. You know who it is. This is your boy, C3 U3 B3A, aka Kuba the Cupid, aka I shoot you with my big arrow, aka I ain't getting shit. So I put together a list of 10 sexy fragrances for you to wear on Valentine's Day to woo your significant other. Or maybe this is your first date type scenario and you still want to make sure you're smelling sexy because you're gonna spend a grip on the three course meal because everything on Valentine's Day is bumped up at least 15%. That's just the name of the game. So let's start saving you a little bit of bread and the smell good category and the first one I'm gonna start off with is one I gave massive amount of kudos I did a very intense detailed review on putting this at the top of the Yves Saint Laurent tuxedo clone the tux by Mason Alhambra not much more I can say about this particular fragrance that I didn't say in the last video I just want to put it out there this is at this point the best Yves Saint Laurent tuxedo clone that I currently own not saying completely out in the market because I don't own them all but it's an amazing amazing scent profile for a sub $60 fragrance that if you're an Yves Saint Laurent tuxedo fan I encourage you to get really quickly because I'm sure prices is gonna go up so Mason Alhambra the tux definitely a sexy option for Valentine's Day for a clone next one this fragrance gets talked about nobody anymore but it's a beautiful Creed green Irish tweed clone that has great performance on it and this is Haramain's L'Aventure Night for me this ends up being green and slightly creamier smoother almost concoction of green soapy lemon verbena beautiful scent profile extremely versatile if you're doing something outdoors if you're in warmer climate and you just want the brisk air to pick up something that won't offend her and you still smell sexy confident and classical this is a beautiful clone for not too much money not many people talk about it so it's still super affordable and readily available great if you love creed green iris tweet next one right now baccarat rouge 540 is still the undefeated champion of the date night sexy sweet fragrances so for me my selection would be frank olivier's pure addiction because hopefully you're going to be giving her addiction at the end of the night after spending all that money Feel me? Sub 30 bucks, hopefully still in that space. I think I got it in some 20 some odd dollars. Beautiful scent profile. Frank Olivier for the budget fragrances that they produce. Great performance, great longevity, beautiful scent profiles. And they really put some love into these fragrances. Even being such a budget fragrance, it's a beautiful scent profile, a definite alternative that's slightly a little bit smoother than the original Baccarat Rouge 540. So Pure Addiction would be my option for a sexy Valentine's Day clone. Next one. If you use a real, real man, and, and Tom Ford Tuscan Leather is your type of vibe, then you gotta go La Yucca Wam. Often a fragrance that's selected over Tom Ford Tuscan Leather. It's still beautiful, gritty, leathery, raspberry, sweet, sexy, uber masculine. You should just be straddling the chick like a horse with your assless chaps on and still looking absolutely fantastical. You're a character walking out of the show Yellowstone. This is masculinity at its finest with incredible, and I mean incredible, performance coming out of this scent profile. So La Yucca One is not super duper cheap, but cheaper than Tom Ford's Tuscan Leather and might have better performances depending on batch variation. So this is a great alternative to Tom Ford's Tuscan Leather for Valentine's Day. Next one. Old heads like me would appreciate that the sexiness of Valentino V. Mm. So that fragrance is no longer cheap or available, super discontinued. You're gonna be paying two plus, or you can just get Derege 
by Rasasi. This shit is still sexy, fam. I think I'm gonna have to pull this puppy out today because Uncle Kuba's smelling fantastic. This makes me feel like retro sexiness. I don't feel like it's a dated scent profile. I just feel it's sexy, sweet. It has the right amount of floral. It has a little bit of a violet leaf essence. For me, it's kind of like a weird combination of a Fahrenheit sprinkle mixed with a little bit of a Yop Ohm kind of vibe. It's called Jupe, but fancy people call it Yop. It's Jupe. It's got a jupish type Fahrenheit kind of blend, but with its own personality, a beautiful scent profile, amazing performance, sexy, cheap, and perfect for a date night on Valentine's. Next one. That Armani really stronger with you, Oud, is a beautiful scent profile, but who wanna spend that kind of bread? Nowadays, you can get a little bit of a discount using the Dua version, which is Dua's stronger with you, Oud. Stronger with Dua, Oud. Amazing scent profile, great performance, and this is all the mass appeal that you're looking for. If you're shooting for that stronger with you DNA, but you like the Udi base of it, this is an amazing alternative for a super cheap price because usually around the holidays, they always throw around like massive coupons. So you can get this shit for the super low and potentially get it right before Valentine's Day if you're looking to order now. Next one. Because you just can't get away from the fuckboy scent profile, Club De Nuit Intense by Armav, AKA the budget Aventus, the broke man's Aventus. And don't get offended by that commentary because every dude is broke on Valentine's Day. I like to call this a reliable alternative. This clone is widely loved by a ton of people. There's a reason why it held that such a high regard in the clone space because the joint just works. I've gifted this to a few people that have wanted to experience the whole Creed Aventus, but I didn't like them enough to buy them a whole bottle. Never received one complaint. It's usually the fragrance snobs or the people who are really appreciate the artistry of a fragrance that complain about it. Me, I look out for your wallets sometimes. And this is a great alternative if you're looking for that fuckboy scent profile of Creed Aventus. Hey, ladies love it, so I'm not judging. I'm just saying I'm not gonna wear this on Valentine's Day. Next one. Oh, I miss my pure Havan bottle, but right now, Insurrection Wild will have to do. Rayon Tradition's Insurrection Wild is if you're looking for that sweet, sexy, boozy, tobacco-style fragrance that Terry Mugler's Pure Havan has, but don't wanna spend that 250 I think I saw it on eBay for like $250. Are you smoking rocks, Pookie? Dude is bugging out here asking for those crazy prices. This one is an alternative that I recently reacquired. I have a couple of Rayon Tradition clones, but I wanted that pure Havana essence back. I just didn't want to pay the money for it. So I wanted to see if, if this potentially would satisfy my, my pure havana And it does to a certain extent. I still want to get it, but I just don't want to pay the ridiculous scent profile. So if your pure Havan went to shit like my did, Insurrection Wild, definitely the alternative that you're looking for. Next one. If your membership to the Illuminati got turned down but you love Initio Oud for greatness, then you can go the Amazon route and get Oud for glory by Latafa. Amazing clone. Amazing clone. Amazing performance, beautiful scent profile, very comparable, damn near to the presentation. Has to be a particular type of sexy vibe. You gotta be in that fragrance space to really appreciate this scent profile, but it has all the sexiness that you're looking for. Dark, dense, booty, sexy. And at the end of the day, it's all about saving that coin, saving a little bit of bread. Inflation is through the roof. You at least need to save some money on some scented water. And Oud for Glory is an Amazon find that you can get by Valentine's Day to still smell delicious, sexy, and unique. And Finally, when you're on your Perfumes de Marley kick and you want to smell Carlisle, but on a budget, Boroj or Boroj, Pelador. Pelador, Pelador. It sounds like some Spaniard dude playing the Spanish guitar and shit in the middle of a square, waiting for dollar bills to fall on his hat. Great scent profile. Very beautiful, mass appealing, sweet, sexy, dark, nutty, cinnamony. A really perfect scent situation for you to kind of picture what you're gonna be doing at the end of the night. I don't know if there's any subliminal things going on in this video, but if you wear this fragrance, chances are you might be doing something, flicking with something, rubbing something, motorboating something. At the end of the day, Empelador can definitely help satisfy that Perfumes de Marley Carlisle need on a budget. These are the 10 fragrances that I recommend are super sexy to wear on your Valentine's Day lituation, and they're all in the clone space. So they're all budget friendly, sexy, all have very good performances, and will save you a little bit of bread while you get the pair of socks or the shirt that's too tight, but it was really your kids, while you spent like $7,000 on like a tennis bracelet. I'm not speaking from experience, but I'm saying, if anybody wants to set up a GoFundMe, I'll put the link in the description. I love y'all mother suckers from the heart. You have a beautiful Valentine's Day, and I'll see y'all sisters next time. You know what is biggest in the game. Smooches.
What's fresh? Who is best? One of them's gonna pass the test. Who by the Fly gun holder, money folder, roller roller, star tag. When it's time to call back, uh, for the rough, rugged, and raw way, this nigga Jay gets a game, but he don't play. Hey, for all the chicks that got dead in the penthouse suite on top of my mom's crib, hey. it's long since you never get in. It's long since you would think that you would. <laughs>